Welcome Virgos! Oh my Virgos! Welcome, welcome, welcome. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back Virgos. Um, remember, uh, this is an extended reading. This is the monthly readings and whenever you pick it up, it's about a four weeks period. You can see these four weeks. All right, this is about a four weeks period. And you got a lot of money. So Virgos, if you have a business, money is going to be coming in. There it is. Seven of Pentacles. So Virgos, this is going to be a very, very lucky, lucky time for you, Virgos, when it comes on uh, to work and business and career. So what energies we have here? Let's see what we have here, Virgos. Uh, we have uh, the energies. I don't know why they use this type of, um, three of swords. So whatever that was transpiring, um, you had some sort of a heartbreaks that you were dealing with. Um, you're going to be overcoming this heartbreaks. Okay. So the energy of the three of swords is that you're coming in, leaving the month, to, um, the four weeks before this coming in and you had some sort of a heartbreaks. In this period, the art breaks is going to be over. And why the art breaks is going to be over is that you're going to be successful. Another energy of the three. So number 33 is going to be a major, major situation that is transpiring around you, Virgos, at the workplace uh, and, uh, um, and at uh, work. A major, major situation that is going to be transpiring. So, what we're seeing, Virgo, and this is going to be a really pleasant, pleasant, pleasant month, is that in the the um, crowning of your reading, we have the energy of the Eight of Wheels. The Eight of Wheels is about the Eight of Pentacles, the Eight of Wheels. The Eight of Wheels, and it is in the reverse. Now, the energy with this Eight of Wheels is in reverse. Then we have the Six of Swords. So, it's as if uh, a lot of you are thinking, oh, you know, my business, my work isn't doing well or my project isn't doing well. No, 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 no. Give it time, ladies and gentlemen, some sort of a problem. Give it time because in your stability, when you can receive this same seven of wheels, you have the eight of wheels and you have the seven of wheels. And this is where. A lot of you are going to start questioning yourself. And the question you're going to be asking is, uh, what is best? Should I work for myself or should I go back in service? You know, you know, this is the question that you're asking because a lot of you recognize that you have been working for yourself. And you have been creating a whole lot of wealth. And it is going to be a time period where you're going to be trying to figure out, is this better? Now, the first week is going to be that you're going to be successfully, successfully overcoming some sort of an issues, problem, information that you got, some sort of a loss that you have. You're going to be successful overcoming this loss that you have. And it was a situation where a Libran tried to create a lot of problems or you could add, add some legal issue. And you successfully overcome in this. It's not yet over because you are still dealing with the five of swords. At least your worries is over. And you were dealing, you businessmen have been feeling it because this is the night of Pentacles, especially young entrepreneur. You're going to be feeling this shift of energy. And here we have the young entrepreneur. This is the night of wheels that is going to be feeling it. But listen, you have something that is stable. You have something, this project that you're working on. Is going to be bringing you so much um, financial success in the future. You're just not seeing it yet. And, you know, despite the loss that you have had with a legal issue, you are going to be balancing this out. Okay. So a lot of you could be worried about the loss because a lot of you have gotten yourself in some sort of a 
legal issues, um, especially people who are entrepreneur or freelancers or so. And now you're going to be recognizing, hey, there has, you are going to be successful and you're going to be successful. And even though um, you think as if your project, your business, this freelance project is, uh, you know, am I going to lose it or, you know, am I going to um, have more business coming? The five of sorts is saying not to worry, don't worry, because, uh, you know, everything has a season, you know, even at the workplace, uh, um, there was a whole lot of happiness and then it, it can die down because people had to focus on their work. However, this is going on is the same thing as in business. So a lot of people at the workplace um, and people who are in service um, and when we talk about service, we're talking about nine to five um, is going to be recognizing that there is a lot of people that has been really you have been planting and creating for yourself, but people are just greedy and has been, you know, eating. It's as if you're planting your, um, you have your business and a lot of people have been profiting from your business, either stealing your idea or has been stealing from your business. And a lot of you are going to be finding this out. So follow us to find out what is this all about? Because obviously a lot of you are, um, is go you're going to be finding out that a lot of people have been profiting from your business without even you even knowing. And I think that this is where some sort of a stop or some sort of an end needs to come to this because a lot of you are going to be, Jesus, I've been working so hard on my business. But if you notice, you're going to be successfully recognize this because you have lost a lot in the past. You've really lost a lot of business, a lot of, um, um, time effort um on the work floor that you have given in ideas information in order to bring a balance at the workplace and people just took your idea and use it as if it was theirs also in um your own projects and business people just took your ideas you know so you have lost in the sense but you're going to be successful anyway and you're going to be successfully overcoming these people that was profiting from you it is finally going to come to an end it is really finally going to be coming to an end and especially you young entrepreneur men i see that you're going to be recognizing oh my god um it was my idea i created and a whole lot of people was really profiting and taking from me so men and women between the ages of 19 and 25 you're going to be having that your co-workers have been basically you know, taking your ideas and running with it and using it as if oh, it was their ideas. But at some point, it's as if this is the month that people are going to be recognizing, hey, it is Virgo's idea. This idea is not coming from um, the, the Aquarian because a lot of you are going to be dealing with Aquarian. And when we deal with Aquarian, um, a lot of you, Aquarian could be investigating your business or Aquarian, um, you're dealing with some sort of an authoritarian figure, okay, um, that you're dealing with. So if you notice you're dealing um, with the Tauruses, a lot of you are going to be recognizing something about a Taurus. Um, who is this Taurus? Is this Taurus your boss? But you're going to be recognizing a whole lot of something about the stories you're going to be recognizing some of you the stories could be a boss or it could be a co-worker but whatever it is the energy of the six of swords some sort of an information is going to be coming out about a taurus at the workplace and i see you virgos we're not aware of the stories but i see you are going to be successfully overcoming the stories because whatever is coming out is going to be that you're rebalancing but Virgos I see you young people are in the reverse and it's as if you wrong people are in the reverse because something you recognize that there was some sort of a foul play either um that someone uh screwed you by taking your idea and giving it to the boss some sort of a data or information or someone has access your data or information and it's as if uh, um, whatever is transpiring, but does heartbreaks, if you notice, is in, in the, the reverse. So this loss 
you leave the period before coming in this month and recognizing that you have a huge loss and this huge loss for some of you has to do with people profiting from your business people profiting from your idea okay so you gotta recognize this but you're going to be successful this is a three of cups being very successful moving and recognizing this okay because so you could have not had realized what was happening and transpiring so that is a good thing but it is it is affecting people who are in nine to five jobs it is affecting people who have their own um, business that people I've been taking your ideas and has been running with it. Now, the energy of the five of swords and the energy with the five of swords, this energy of the five of swords, what is this saying? Um, it is that a lot of you Virgos are going to be coming in. It's as if you're, you are going to be, um, standing your ground. This, this five of swords, you're going to be clearly communicating about the dishonesty. Of what was going on with your project the dishonesty of what was going on on the work floor a lot of you are going to be very successful and especially women you are going to be the successors okay you women are going to be showing up and really communicating really showing up things that was happening things that was um placed on the need the um of that was going on that people not were not aware of and you're going to be successfully bringing this so um but bringing this up and showing it up but men you're doing this wrong you know you're fighting your battle in the reverse and you're going after people in power not recognizing what you're doing so i need you young men to re um re-engage to in trying to resolve some sort of a situation. I know you have lost uh, a whole lot, but you know, young men re-engage, re-engage. Okay. Flip this. Okay. Communicate care, um, properly. And, and then you will get some sort of a result. So whatever is happening and transpiring, I want you men to communicate properly to not see, um, the communication that is coming at you men is not going to be good. And then you're returning the same sort of energy. And it's just as if, hey, Virgos, hey, back up, back up, back up, back up. Um, recognize that um, the communication that is coming, not really positive, but try and work it out, okay? A lot of you Virgos might have to um, be... Um, some sort of information, some sort of money could be coming in because this is a page of ones and it's as if a lot of you businessmen or uh, um, could have to be paying back a whole lot of money like taxes, okay? So a lot of you young entrepreneurs have to be paying back a whole lot of taxes. I don't see it's returning to you. I see you are paying, okay? Whenever we look at Aquarian energies, it's always repaying back taxes, okay? So a lot of you young men, um, especially young entrepreneur men, have to pay a whole lot of back taxes. So you got to be aware of this. A lot of you are dealing um, with a cancer. And whoever this cancer is, a lot of you are going to be recognizing that this cancer has been creating a lot of drama in your world. So Virgos and a, and a Libra and a Cancer, a, some sort of a communication. This first, these two people could be creating a whole lot of issue on the work floor. You got to be aware of this. Pull it, get it on the control from now, Virgos. Um, because a lot of you Virgos are going to be recognizing that they have been um creating a whole lot of shift. Okay, um, management, you got to pull this up. Okay, a lot of business people. Some sort of a sadness is going to be transpiring um, where you are going to be recognizing that you have to um, repay a whole lot of uh, damage. And um, it is a situation where it's as if it's your karma. You, you got to learn um, about what has transpired. This is looking like a lot of karma that a lot of you have to deal with. So recognize this. Um, a lot of you... Because uh, 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 uh. I, I see 
yes a lot of you have to be repaying it's as if some of you had take some sort of a service from someone and uh, um you have not paid the full contract or you broke the contract they're going to be advising you virgos men virgo entrepreneurs that you need to pay this person full contract um, because this person had opened up their time, you had signed this contract, they're going to be looking over this contract and recognize um, that you, Virgos, have to pay out this contract, okay? And that is just for entrepreneur. For the rest of you, I see, especially women, Virgo women, you're going to be very good. Virgo women, expect... A whole lot of uh, positive transition in your world where positions could be open up for you Virgo women Virgo men this is where you got to really step back and look at how you are going to be dealing with this month it's a dollar 99 ladies and gentlemen follow me to the other side then you know how to resolve these issues I do love you guys I gotta go please like share thumbs up thumbs up show your love by thumbs up so that these videos share, share, share. Namaste.